Um, it's your girl tall trans and I'm currently recording from my car duh so we are my son and I getting ready to move to another state as you know I currently live in Savannah Georgia and tomorrow we are going to be driving out to North Carolina we have a lot to do and I'm already tired but what's up y'all that's my son what Josh how y'all doing this is the beginning all right so this is the moving we're doing excuse the ghetto ness in the back there you see that sheet hanging from nails for some privacy while we're getting all our stuff out the way just yesterday i had to help my sister move her stuff in a storage unit and we get to get do this all over again for our stuff you see josh is over here doing his thing i wanted to show y'all this because we did get a dolly you know the regular orange dollies from the u-haul but that wasn't going to be enough for us so I went to Home Depot and we found this four-in-one hand truck with nose plate extension thing. And it's really cool. I know it sounds funny, but I didn't know they exist, Josh. And it has like instructions on the back. And I think it's up to a thousand pounds in weight and it has these puncture proof tires. I'm going to let you know how this thing's hold up. It was quite an investment. I think it was $229, but that's cheaper than hiring movers. <laughs> so um, I'm able to stack quite a bit of boxes out and it fits on the ramp. Let me show you the U-Haul ramp. I'm pretty sure y'all all know what that looks like. But um, let's go out here. So it fits really well up the ramp and it's been making stuff very easy for me because it's just my son. And us, it's like my son and I, we are the ones that's doing everything. So we're trying to um, be smart about energy and resources. So I'll check with y'all back soon. I don't know how long this is going to take, but pray for us. Bye. So it's moving day and I need to be in North Carolina by noon. It's 6.30 and my son and I still have a lot to do. I'm exhausted and it's cold, it's cold. I think it's like 30 something degrees outside. You see my wigs in the background saying hi. <laughs> so, <sighs> I think we need to move the garbage to the front. Bulk day is coming up perfect timing and I need to deflate my bed over here more wigs do you see all the wigs dang so I gotta let that down and zip up my storage bags for my clothes I think my son got up before me and he started doing a little something to help me out <laughs> let's see what he's doing yeah my son's already up and I, I guess he took the liberty of putting his mattress on the truck we still have to uninstall this light this is a light that I put over my desk so when I was making my wigs and doing my nails I could see we got to take down our little makeshift uh, curtain there and we have to patch two holes and paint over them. So I'm going to get dressed. And then there's a lot of stuff over there in that corner that we didn't put up yet. So I'm going to get dressed. Wow, it's freezing. And start helping out. All right, she's empty. This is where we stayed for the last year and a half. Living in Savannah was interesting. Got our butts kicked. It was experience. We learned a lot about ourselves and we're not gonna make the same mistakes again. All right, y'all, it's eight o'clock. Perfect timing. We were supposed to be out of here by eight, 8.15. We're gonna stop and yeah, I'm coming. Um, we're gonna check the house one more time. We did our videos, got the professional cleaning done. <sighs> wow, I'm not gonna do this again for a very long time. Josh, say hi. What's up, y'all? Bye. 
my son and I finished emptying out the U-Haul and here's the chaos of trying to live and function. So today I'm gonna get my room together because I work from home. So I have my new air mattress expanding. It came in a box. So not air mattress, my new mattress expanding because it came in a box. And so it takes a couple of days to get to I guess the correct thickness or whatever. Excuse me if I'm lost for words because I'm exhausted. So I am going to do the peeling stick on my electric desk that I've had for some years now. It's a great desk, it's from Germany. So I'm definitely not getting rid of it, but it could use a touch up and I'm really excited about the peeling stick that I got. So I'll show you all what that looks like later. Um, last couple of days I have been sleeping on this uh, air mattress. I'm about to get this out the way so I can put together my bed frame, which I'm really excited about. I'll give you all the details of everything new that I've purchased for this place. This is my bathroom. There is a lot going on in here. If you see anything concerning, just look away. And then the my closet is in the bathroom, past the bathroom, that's interesting, yes. Those are a pair of beat up joggers that I'm using for a floor mat at the moment. Um, I got some stuff from American Tall that I'm excited about. Some of it didn't fit more on that way later. Um, and that side of the house is my sunroom, which I'm not gonna venture into right now. He probably wants some privacy. But until the next time, bye.